Welcome to a Pilates workout. My name is Marissa. Breathe here. Lift yourself up and walk your hands to the right diagonal, separating your hands shoulder distance apart. Drop your forehead down. Let's do it over to the opposite side. Your hands go shoulder distance apart, dropping your forehead down. Come back to center. Stretch forward. Stay stretching forward. Just giving you the side view again. Walk your hands in, undo the legs. Once again, come down onto your elbows. Lift your heart. Then come down, the back of your shoulders down. Breathe here. Separate your feet as wide as the sticky mat and let your knees come in to touch each other. Take your arms to a cactus pose, the back of your elbows down. Drop both of your knees over to your right. Turn your nose to the left. Stay in the twist. Take your right ankle on top of your left thigh, getting a stretch to the top of your left hip flexor. Breathe here. Let the right ankle fall to the ground where it was moments ago. Turn your nose to the ceiling. Let your knees come back to center, the knees together, the feet wide apart. Drop both of your knees over to your left Turn your nose to the right. Then just like we did on the first side, add your left ankle on top of the right thigh, getting a tug for the top of the right hip flexor. So you're assisting gravity in stretching out and adding some weight to the top of the right leg. Let the left ankle fall to the floor where it was moments ago. Turn your nose towards the ceiling. Let the knees come back into center. The knees are touching and the feet are wide. Take your hands down by your side, your palms face down. Walk your feet together. So before we had the feet wide apart, before that we had the feet hip width apart. Now the feet are together, the knees are together. Everything is zipped together. Without using your hands, take your knees into your chest. So your hands stay down, but your knees are into your chest. Then take your legs straight up to the sky. You're flexing your feet. Lower your straight legs halfway down. We'll make circles. The knees go in and up halfway down. Three in and up halfway down. Four in and up halfway down. Five in and up halfway down. Six in and up halfway down. Seven in and up halfway down, eight in and up halfway down. Let's reverse those circles. Go up and in and out, low off the ground. Two up and in and out, three up and in and out, four up and in and out, five up and in and out, six up and in and out. Seven up and in and out. Eight up and in and out. Pose here, pause here, breathe here. Lift your legs straight up to the sky. Separate your feet a few inches apart. Bend your knees, step your feet down onto the wood. Lift your hips up. Snuggle your shoulders onto your back. Breathe here. Lower yourself down to the mat. Stack your hands behind your head. It's a little bit different than clasping your hands. So you have one hand stacked behind the other. Keep your elbows wide apart. Lift your upper body up with your elbows wide apart. And then lower yourself back down with the elbows wide apart. So it's two up and down. We're coming up on the exhale, inhaling down. Four up and down. Five up and down, 
six up and down, seven up and down, eight, do it again, eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one, stay up, reach your hands outside of your hips, your palms are face down a few inches off the ground, looking towards your belly and pump your arms, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, three more sets, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two more sets, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, last set, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, stay this lifted, stack your hands behind your head, lower your upper body down, take your feet off the ground, making your shins parallel to the ceiling, zip your legs together, flex your feet, as if you were going over a barrel without changing the degree of the bend in the knees, tap your heels down and come up to down, your upper body stays down, just the legs moving down and up, four down and up, five down and up, six down and up, seven down, and up, eight, let's change it, keep the legs, but lift your upper body up, your elbows wide apart, tap your heels down, and up, two down, and up, three down, and up, four down, and up, five down, and up, six down, and up, seven down, and up, eight down, let's tap the head and the heels down and up, two sets, two, up, three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, up, eight, we have one more set, eight, up, seven, up, Six, up, five, up, four, up, three, up, two, up, one, up. Stay up, reach your hands outside of your hips, your palms face down. Look into your belly, the hands are only two inches off the ground. Pump your arms. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, three more sets. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two more sets. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, last set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Stack your hands behind your head. Lower your upper body down. Take your legs straight up to the sky. Point your feet. Pause here. Breathe here. Imagine again that you're zipping up a tight pair of jeans. So you're hugging your abdominals in that your navel, your belly button, is going down towards the floor and up towards your nose. So you have this engagement at your core. You still have the foundation of your breathing. Breathe here. Keep the legs as they are. Just lift your upper body up and down. Two up and down. Three up and down. Four up and down. Five up and down. Six up and down, seven up and down, eight up and down. Take your arms down by your side, your palms face down. Keep your right leg straight up to the sky. Lower your left leg all the way down. Take your left arm straight up to the ceiling. Lift your head, your neck, your shoulders up. Flex your feet. Let's tap the left hand and right leg towards each other. They go down away from each other to the ground. So you're coming up with your head and limbs and down. So we're going up three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, another set, eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one. Let's stay up, clasp your hands behind this right thigh, lift your head, neck, and shoulders up, point your right foot, 
Walk your hands up towards your ankle. Breathe here like you're climbing a tree, one hand over the other. Stretch here. Let's point both feet. Breathe here. Reflex your feet. Walk your hands back down behind your right thigh. Lower your head, neck, and shoulders down. Broaden across the collarbone that you have a little bit more space across your chest. Rebend this right knee, clasp your hands into your chest, flex your foot. Lower your hands down by your side, take your right leg straight up to the sky, lower the straight leg all the way down. Lift your left leg straight up to the sky, flex your foot. Take your right arm straight up to the ceiling. Let's point the feet and flex the feet. Keep the feet flexed. Lift your head, neck, and shoulders like these two limbs are going to touch each other. They go away from each other to touch the ground. Two, touch, down. Three, four, five, down. Six, down. Seven, down. Eight, again. Eight, down. Seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one. Stay up, clasp your hands behind this left thigh, then point your foot, point both feet, walk your hands up like you're climbing a tree, up towards your left ankle, stretch here, breathe here. Reflex your feet, walk your hands back down, clasping your hands behind the thigh, lower your head, neck, and shoulders down. We bend this knee, clasping your hands over your shin, flexing your foot. Lower your hands down by your side, take your left leg straight up to the sky, lower the straight leg all the way down. Reach your arms straight back behind you, your hands are landing, shoulder distance apart. Flex your feet, then point your feet. Flex your feet, then point your feet. Flex your feet, then point your feet. Flex, relax, lower your hands down by your side. Turn your palms up, rest for a moment in a total relaxation. Just dropping. You have this connection to your breathing, this connection to your core, and now you're le letting go. Just rest for a moment. So instead of working until exhaustion, we work and we back off a little bit, and then we come back so we can work even stronger. Then turn your palms down. Bend your knees, stepping your feet onto the mat. Take your arms to a cactus pose. Take the knees into your chest without using your arms. Zip your knees together. Drop your knees over to your right elbow. Turn your nose to the left. See if you can get your legs into a right angle so that your knees are in line with your hip bones and the feet are in line with the knees. It's a 90 degree angle with the legs. Turn your nose to the left, you're in a stretch. Then turn your nose towards the ceiling. Stack your hands behind your head. Your elbows go wide apart. Lift your upper body up and down. Two up and down. Three up and down. Four up and down. Five up and down. Six up and down. Seven up and down. Eight, do it again. Eight, down. Seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one. Stay up, see if you can get that right shoulder off the ground. Lower yourself back down, take your arms to that cactus pose, take the knees back into center, the knees come very close into your chest without using your hands. Then drop your knees all the way over to your left elbow. 
Your legs are in that 90 degree angle. Turn your nose to look past your right shoulder. Breathe here. So we have all these sharp lines of energy with the elbows coming down, the shoulders going into your back. There's a stretch across your chest like the bottom tips of your shoulder blades are pushing forward to your heart, presenting your heart to the sky. Let's keep the legs in this formation. Stack your hands behind your head. Your elbows go wide apart. You're looking straight up and rising straight up. Two sets. Lift up two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, again, eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one, stay up, the left shoulder coming off the ground, breathe here. Lower yourself back down. Take your arms to a cactus pose. Take your knees back into center. Take your hands to outside of your feet. You're coming to a happy baby pose. The arms are leveraged on the inside of the leg. Let's keep the right foot where it is. Lengthen your left leg long out in front of you. Your left hand down by your side, your palm face down. You're in half happy baby. What is it to stay with something, perhaps even a little bit longer than you hoped for? What comes up when you settle down? Let's return to full happy baby. Then lengthen your right leg long on the ground out in front of you, your right hand down by your side, you're in half happy baby on the second side. back to full happy baby. In midair, take the soles of your feet together and your knees wide apart. Then keep the soles of the feet together, your knees wide apart. Take your hands down by your side. Tap the pinky sides of your feet down to the ground and bring them back up. Two down and up. Three down and up. Four down and up. Five down and up six down and up, seven down and up, eight down and up, another set, eight, lift, seven, lift, six, lift, five, lift, four, up, three, up, two, up, one, up, hold it on the way up, widen your knees apart, then go back down, the soles of the feet together, the knees wide apart. Take your hands to your thighs, encouraging the thighs to open. With your nose pointed straight to the ceiling, just pause here, breathe here. To your left side, take your left arm under you. You're in one straight line. This right hand can be on high finger pads like a kickstand. Now from that one straight line, keep your legs zipped together and just move your feet forward a little bit so they're on a diagonal. Then flex your feet and lift your top leg up. It's not coming up very high and then lower it down. Maybe it's hip height. Two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, do it again, eight, down, seven, you're working your inner thighs on the way down, six, you're squeezing in, five, four, three, two, one, 
let's bend the knees. They're in line with the hips. Your feet are in line with the knees. So again, we have that 90 degree right angle. We'll flex the feet and keep the ankles together. Just lift your top knee and lower it down like a clamshell. Two sets, two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, we'll do it again. Eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one, down. Now keep the knees together and flex the feet. Keep the top, let's lift the top leg and lower. Two, down, three, down. It's the ankle. Down, five, down, six, down, seven, down. Let's do it again, another eight. Eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one. Let's lift the top knee and the top ankle. Notice how you're not lifting with the knee first or the ankle first, but you're coming up with a straight line. So we're lifting up and down, squeezing the inner thighs on the way down. So it's not only working the way up, you're working on the way down. Four up and down, five up and down, six up and down, seven up, and down, eight up, again. Eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one. Let's lift that top leg up, move the knee in towards your elbow, go back no straighter than the bottom leg and come down. So we're going up, in, return, down. Two up, in, return, down. Three up, in, return, down. Four up, in, return, down. Five up, in, return, down. Six up, in, return, down. Seven up, in, return, down. Eight up, in, return, again. Eight in, return, down, seven, in, return, down, six, in, return, down, five, in, return, down, four, in, return, down, three, in, return, down, two, in, return, down, one, in, return, down, breathe here. Let's come up on our side and then open your legs facing forward. Your legs go wide apart. You're flexing your feet. Your toes are pulling towards your ears. Walk your hands forward. Your hands are shoulder distance apart. You're up on these high finger pads. Lift your heart. Breathe here. As you're lifting your heart, your shoulders are flowing down your back. Let's walk the hands in. Let's come to lay down on the second side. You'll lengthen yourself all the way out into one strong, long line. You'll flex your feet. Then from there, just move your feet a little bit forward so you have this kind of little diagonal here. The left hand going up onto high finger pads. You'll flex your feet. Just lift the top leg, not too high, maybe hip height, and down. Two, down, three, down four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, do it again, eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one, down, Bend your knees and bring the knees in line with the hip, the feet in line with the knees. Let's keep the ankles together. Lift your top knee like a clamshell and down. Two sets. Two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, 
E again. E down. Seven down. Six down. Five down. Four down. Three down. Two down. One. Keep the knees together. Flex your feet. Lift the top ankle and down. Two sets. Two down. Three down. Four down. Five down. Six down. Seven down. Eight. Do it again. Eight down. Seven down. Six down. Five down. Four down. Three down. Two down. One down. Let's lift the top knee and the top ankle. One down. Two, work on the way down, squeezing. Three, down, so you're working up and down. Five, six, down, seven, down. Eight, again. Eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one, down. Let's do that same thing of lifting the top leg, but now bring the knee in towards your elbow. Take the leg back, but no straighter than the bottom leg and come down. So we're going up, in, return, down. Three up, in, return, down. Four up, in, return, down. Five up, in, return, down. Six up, in, return, down. Seven up, in, return, down. Eight up, in, return, again, eight, in, return, down, seven, in, return, down, six, in, return, down, five, in, return, down, four, in, return, down, three, in, return, down, two, in, return, down, one, in, return, down. Let's come up to all fours. So we're coming up to hands and knees. We'll tuck the toes. The knees are under the hips. The hands are under the shoulders. So the hands are shoulder distance apart and the knees are hip width apart. Let's lift the right knee up. We're flexing the foot. The right thigh is parallel to the ground. Again, you have this 90 degree right angle. We're taking the knee and the foot down. So the key here is to make sure that you have equal pressure in that right foot, just like you have pressure in the left foot. Don't get very light on the right foot as we continue. So the right leg goes up. We have two sets. This is three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, again, eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one. Let's do it with the left leg, that same exercise coming up. The foot is flexed, you have that 90 degree right angle. When you come down, make sure you have that equal pressure in the left foot that you already have in the right, and make sure your toes are tucked. Let's try it. So we have two up and down. Three up and down, four up and down, five down, six down, seven down, eight again, eight down, seven down, six down, five down, four down, three down, two down, one down. Let's go to a plank position. Extend your right leg long back behind you, followed by your left leg. You're in this one strong long line. Make sure that your hips are not sagging. That would be way too much pressure in your shoulders. Instead, your hips are lifted as high as your shoulders. You're not only pushing down into your hands, instead you're pushing forward. So there's this connection of the head of the arm bones into the shoulder socket. Lower your knees down and walk your knees under the hips where they were moments ago. So here we are in all fours, hands and knees. Let's straighten the right leg long back behind us. We'll keep that there. Let's lift the left knee and the left foot up 
and down. Two sets, two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, again, eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one, go to a plank position, top of a push-up. Lower your knees down, move your knees back under the hips. The knees are hip width apart, the feet are hip width apart, you're tucking the toes on the mat. Slide your left leg long back behind you, flex your foot, lift the right knee and the right foot up and down. Two sets, two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, again, eight, down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, one, go to a plank position, top of a push-up, go upwards and backwards, downward facing dog, breathe here, breath comes, breath goes. Come forward to plank, your shoulders over your ribs. Take your knees down, take your knees wide apart. Send your pedicures to the floor, bring the big toes to touch. Send your butt backwards, stretch here, outstretching the arms. Lower your forehead down. Stay here in this child's pose. I wanna just check on the time. You're staying in child's pose. Oh, perfect timing. Let's take the legs wide apart after your child's pose. Flex your feet, take your arms to that T-shape. We did this in the beginning. Let's twist over to the right, but now we're gonna add to it. Take your left hand outside your right pinky toe, look back at your back hand and turn that palm up. Let's make it smooth. Come all the way back to center and then twist. Three, up, four, Five, up, six, up, seven, up, eight, up. Let's go to that twist and stay in the twist. Breathe here, stretch here. Come all the way back up to center. Let's do it over to the left. Do this first one, twisting, coming down, turning the palm up and looking backward, and then we'll make it smooth. Come back up. So here's two, twisting and dipping and coming back up. Three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, up, eight, up. Let's go to that same twist and hold it. Breathe here. Come back up. Take your hands down, take your legs out in front of you, flex your feet, lift your arms to the ceiling, take your hands out by your sides and then the palms come down outside of the hips, just sitting here nice and tall. Then separate the feet as wide as your hips, your knees are bent towards the sky, move your hands behind you, your palms are face down, broaden across the collarbones, your fingers are facing towards your heels, Lift your hips up, breathe here. You're in a reverse tabletop. You're stretching out your front body, stretching across your chest. Let's come to sit down, cross your legs, and take your hands to prayer in front of your heart. I hope you enjoyed this Pilates session.